Um, so a lot of you guys were asking how I clean or how I'm planning on organizing the pantry. Um, basically, I'm still not gonna 100% keep these um, containers because these were my previous ones. I'm gonna use these temporarily until we're able to 100% do the pantry. It's slowly but surely gonna get together. Um, right now, I'm just putting things as, as I could fix them because right now we obviously are not stable enough to do, you know, 100% things. These are just wants, not needs. So I told myself I was going to go at my pace and what I can do my best on. I switched all of these like containers that are just in the way up here. I don't know 100% how I'm going to put this, but I'm definitely moving all the snacks that were down there up here because of Ryder. And I'm going to leave this as I can, try to like... I don't know maintain it where he can't really reach i do have a lot to put away still so okay so it's probably half an hour later and we made progress i'm really happy with how i fixed it it's more organized i took out a lot that expired mainly like things that were just gonna get stale over time and so here's all the breakfast stuff so i put all the containers on one side because i would obviously know this bigger one is cereal sugar so those two we don't really need so I have those in the back, but I do have oatmeal, yolk, um, granola, and our hemp, chia, and flaxseed mix. And then I have clearly like our spreads, maple syrup, pancake syrup, honey, coffee, brown sugar. So I have it all in a row that I use. I have tea in the back, um, Ryder's baby cereal that I use for his pancakes, pancake mix, these really good protein muffins that we've tried. They were really, really good. I recommend and then I obviously had to fix this whole situation. I don't know if I did it before. I really wish I did like a good before. I put my beans in a container, again, temporarily. Rice in a container. All my pastas in the back. I have some chiles de arbol, chile bajillo, and chile um, ancho. My brown rice, my quinoa, is that quinoa, something like that. And then I have my soups, lentil. I don't know what this is. So I would have to see what kind of recipe. And then my chicken bouillon, hot sauce, tahin, some other seasonings, everything but the bagel. Down here is mainly like the baking stuff we have. Um, I have confectional sugar, cupcake holders, sprinkles, um, all my toppings I use for oatmeal or anything. And then my flour, almond flour, canned fruit, canned coconut milk, um condensed milk cinnamon sticks vanilla chocolate chips baking powder and then down here is all like our bowls our um side dishes that we use my little trays wine cups aluminum foil fork spoons knives and then our water bottles up here is where i put all the good stuff away from Ryder. um let me get on the ladder so i can show you because i can't show you from here Ryder's waking up, so I have to be more quiet. So here have his snacks left of baby snacks, our plates, and then all our granola bars from Chewy, some chips. We got like a little better chips for us to share with Ryder in case there's always that one moment. He's waking up. Um, all our Ritz cookie wise, baby cookies. He loves these cookies and these saltines, um, pistachios, chocolate covered almonds, again our little kid granolas, Ryder's favorite, <laughs> and then candy. All of this is all my extras, extra oatmeal, extra granola, extra cereal in the back, extra coffee, garlic, seasonings, jam, ketchup, um, oil, mayo iced tea mixture anything extra that i have is up here plus our plastic cups so more organized i'm gonna go get him to sleep in better once he cries i'm gonna also put these in the fridge see this is all the aftermath of like cleaning basically i just clean like the whole fridge outside and inside this is what I mean. We gotta improvise. You gotta improvise. He does like them cold. Didn't want them falling everywhere. So I'm just gonna leave them like that. I would have put them up there, but I don't like how it looked. I'm gonna get more containers. 
but this is how it looks our juices our beverages all our um veggies fruits cheese ham whatever is down there all our milk is here as you can see we are almond milk lovers and oat milk lovers for Ryder loves oat milk for some reason and i am thinking of switching him to this type of milk once he's done with the formula at the end of this month and then here we have yogurt ricotta cheese um salsa mayo hershey's syrup leggera syrup um pasta sauce tortillas um so oh, we also have cream cheese and butter there the freezer is the only thing i do have to deep clean but i think i'm gonna do that tomorrow morning actually um since i enter later i think i'm gonna do a smoothie tomorrow or an acai or a smoothie bowl i don't have the acai but i also moved the ziploc bags there because it's so much easier to pack fruits and stuff for Ryder. so Babe. Yeah. Babe. Yeah. Love. Sorry on my um Sunday. Friday morning. Oh. <laughs> so it's the next day. Ryder's eating some fruit. Say hi. Say hello. Good morning. <laughs> um I cleaned he woke up at six thirty today. Um so I woke up and I cleaned his room. I am going to do this thing where I switch up his toys and I let him see what he has. Um, once he gets fully bored with them, then I'm, um, it's called Toy Rotation. I saw it from this one YouTuber and it gave me a great idea. I fixed his closet. I was going to start washing, but I'm not going to have time to full clothes put away. So I'm going to wash tomorrow if not Tuesday, because we do have to go get baby Ryder's birthday stuff. Um, I did take out the shoes that don't fit him anymore. These still fit him until the end of summer, because it's size four, three to four, and that's what he is now. So once it stops being cold, and it won't fit him by next winter, but it's okay, because this winter coming up, we're going to get him Doc Martens like his mama. So these were great while they lasted they were perfect shoes i am saving his shoes away i'm gonna clean them and put them away in storage so i did take out the other vans and the other nikes so now he's left with the nikes um the red and black ones and the black checkered one i'm gonna go exchange his sandals i got him and get him little vans that are like the old ones he had first i found his two chanclas so and i did stock up on his diapers and white piece for the house we wear no more so that was that and then i came in the bathroom he's showering i cleaned the floor i did rearrange our little setup tomorrow or sometime this week we're gonna put all our workout stuff in the room so it's not in the way because Ryder keeps touching it and then i put the wi-fi boxes higher let's see how it lasts it is very sensitive with the cables on the bottom so i don't know if that's gonna be a problem why is he just eating Say good morning, guys. And she's all good. Say hello. Say hello. I'm gonna quickly make us some brunch slash his lunch. Get us going because it's already good for the And it's raining and it's raining a lot, and I'm a little scared to drive. I already finished mopping, Papa. You're too late to the party. You're so late. You're so late. So I'm watching um, Mama June's Road to Redemption and it's really good. Anyways, I'm gonna make us brunch, not breakfast. Well, it's my breakfast, it's lunch. Huh, but it's lunch time. Say so it's lunch time. It's lunch time. It's a candle. So it's a little later. Ryder's in bed. I change into cozy clothes. I clean our disaster dinner. And I baked myself some cookies. I got um, a dessert. They're called Sweet Lawrence. 
Um, they're so good. Um, oatmeal one, I uh, haven't tried it. I hear it's good too, but I think these are my personal favorites for the moment. And Gustavo and Ryder loves them too, so definitely says something. So I'm just gonna have, I don't know if I should have almond milk or oat milk with it. I already drank almond, oat milk, so I'm gonna take some almond milk. I think one 